Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves at the Ozark Correctional Facility in Missouri, where JC News Now attempts to film the uh, establishment but gets uh, confronted by one of the guards, and he ends up lying his ass off to everybody else in the area about why he's there. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. This is a uh, all drivers for inmates. Hey, how are you doing? Uh, it's pretty obvious what I'm doing. What? Being a royal pain in the ass and uh, filming at a prison where uh, a lot of uh, other frauditors have been arrested in the past because, you know, it's a secure area. Gee, I knew you wanted to go back to jail, but this is just way too obvious, dude. I mean, you should learn from the mistakes of the other frauditors, but I guess you yourself are incapable of that ability to learn. Taking video and you're not allowed to do that. Really. I, I won't go in. You're not allowed to take pictures of the facility at all. Who says? The court. Oh, okay. I'm not on this property. I'm on state property. Uh, were you born this stupid, Jimmy, or did you have to work at it? Because, well, the grounds of that prison don't stop at the uh, fence line. There's a little bit of an extension to it. That way, they can patrol the area. You're essentially standing on prison property, dumbass. You cannot be there, sir. I'll get the, um, I'll get the sheriff down here if you want me to. Yeah, you can call whoever you want. Okay, what's your name? My name is Hilton. Okay. Thanks, Hilton. Why are, why are you taking pictures? I'm working on a story. Oh, that's the excuse all the damn time. I'm working on a story, but you never really have a story that you publish. The only thing you publish are, uh, are videos of you being totally antagonistic to anybody who approaches you about what you're doing. Speaking of being antagonistic, uh... How's that thing with the dispensary going? You know, the one where that guy uh, struck you? Oh, wait, now I remember. He was let off the hook because, well, your video showed how much of an ass you were being. Well, wonders never cease. Well, you can't be, can't, we have publicists that, that handle that and talk to them. You don't, you don't take pictures of them. I know, they doctor it, though. Mine's raw and uncut. Okay, good luck with that. <laughs> All right, there you have it. Yeah, there's no towers around here. Well, at this point, he spends the next several minutes talking to himself before somebody else pulls up who wants to help him out a little bit. And he uh, outright gives him a bunch of uh, bold-faced lies. So let's go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage. A little longer than a few minutes later. Oh, sir, I'm good. Thank you, though. Hey, I just wanted to make sure. I appreciate you, man. I'm, they're not weirding out on me, are they? Uh, yeah, they kind of are. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because, you know, videotaping people leaving their jobs and stuff. Let them know I'm not up to any ill will. I'm just working on a story. I do correctional centers around the state. From what I've seen of your videos, yeah, you're not exactly a correctional facility guy. You do other things that are low key and just try to get away with it as much as you can. But I guess you just don't want to do correctional facilities because there's a high likelihood of you actually getting arrested at one of those. And I'm sure you want to avoid that at all costs. But hey, no one's stopping you from going to another correctional facility and playing F around and find out. In fact, I would love to see you try that. Uh, I published them. Published them? Yes, sir. What do you mean by published them? I published them. The Kansas City Star, St. Louis Post. Several different outlets I can go with, whoever buys the footage. 
Can you provide any proof of that? Because I really don't buy any story from you at this point in uh, your career. Because, well, from all your videos that I've ever seen, all you ever do is lie. So can you provide proof of that through a citation or uh, actually show a receipt or anything like that? I mean, come on now. Inquiring minds really want to see this stuff so they know you're telling the truth. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. What's your name? I'm an independent journalist. Oh, I got you. I got yeah. you. What's your name? Because I, I read stuff about prisons a lot. Yeah. I'm seen, wondering if I've seen any of your stuff. You can just call me good citizen. Good citizen, I think not, considering that you do have a rather lengthy arrest record, and therefore, you are not exactly an angel when it comes to that. I mean, so you're not exactly a good citizen, so that's a lie right there. But hey, you teach their own. If you want to lie your face off and be untrustworthy to a lot of people, that's your prerogative. I mean, the only thing we have when we die is our reputation. And looks like your reputation, when you pass along in uh, about 30 years from now or something like that, will be one of a uh, no good liar. So uh, that's your own business. But please, carry on. Is, good, is that what you go by? Because if it is, then I can look it up by that. No, you'll see it tonight. Okay. Just look on... Uh... It might be on YouTube. Okay. Maybe. But if anything happens, you need well, of course, you don't want to present them with your channel name because that would be, well, giving away the game and they would be able to shut you down and know your moves. Isn't that right? You're not exactly that stupid, but you're still incredibly stupid when it comes to so many other things. I'll at least give you credit for uh, that, but nothing else. Some water or something, maybe start getting, you know, man, overheated. Just maybe say something to one of the officers out there that maybe I'll get you some water. Your tops, man. I appreciate it. Right on, brother. Y'all be care. safe. Just let them know I'm up to no wheel wheel. Okay, we'll do. Thank you. There's Hilton. You can just call me good citizen. It may be on YouTube tonight. All right, Hilton's trick. Well, you say you have no ill will. How do they know that inside? Because, well, a person filming a prison out uh, just outside the walls is a bit suspect. I mean, did you ever bother to think about that kind of thing? Did you ever bother to use your intelligence? Or is it that you just don't care and uh it's like damn the consequences i gotta get my clickbait footage and everything like that and if i get arrested oh that'll be a lot of clicks and views on that but uh as far as the prison goes there they have a lot of people in there that i'm sure they don't want getting out and if there's somebody outside filming they might be trying to look for a weak spot i mean that's the kind of thing they're trying to look after right there but you know what maybe one day you'll learn maybe you won't but the day will come whenever you try this and you will be arrested for it I at that point, and maybe even prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.